the summer. What is up, big timers? Today, oh geez. Today we are in this little creek, um, and this is the exact creek that John B just made his last video in and shouted my channel out. So I'm here today with my buddy Connor. Here in the next month, I'm turning 16 and getting my driver's license, which means that these kind of trips like this won't happen very much anymore because we've got our bikes over there and we're going to uh we're just gonna ride around and kind of creek hop and see what we can do today um i'm gonna try to catch some bluegill i've got my fly rod and once i catch a bluegill i've got a glass jar in my backpack i'm gonna put the bluegill in the glass jar go to the big like main river of the trinity and we're gonna try to catch like a catfish or gar or something so we're gonna try to trade up today and see what we can do but already been a pretty good birthday with john b um shouting me out oh uh, and he shouted me out right in that parking lot so you got one no way <laughs> and that is connor's first fish in almost a year oh my gosh this is a huge green that sun fish huge. look how small it is Oops. Just across the street, basically, you go that way. Yeah, <laughs> we came from over there though. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Y'all Yeah, we do. Okay. What are you catching? Uh, bluegill, bass. There's a couple catfish in here. Nice. Yeah. Here you go. Thank you, you too. Got one. He ate it. He was just wrapped. That one's probably a little too big for bait. There we go. This is the first strike of the day. Nice, pretty, long ear sunfish on the little nymph fly going in for the release. There he goes. Uh, that one was just a little too big for the um, for the challenge that we're doing, um, trading up. So we're gonna wait till we get a little bit of a smaller bluegill and then we'll put them in the jar. <laughs> Feels so weird saying we're gonna put this little fish in a mason jar that's in my backpack and take somewhere else, but. That's what we're doing. Oh my god, that was so cool. Yeah, on the jig. That was sick. I pitched that jig in there. I thought he saw me for sure, but he apparently didn't. Uh, it yeah, it's really pretty. All right, y'all. So just caught that little bass on that jig right there. I'll show you here in a second, but I pitched it in there and started hopping it a couple times and he just rammed it. Um, Saw it all on camera, but there you go. Good. 
There he goes, right back there. Cool. Watch. Oh, I got one. I got a bass. Is it a bass? Yeah, look. Yeah, we need a bluegill. He wanted the little tiny nymph. This is the one we saw last time, it just ignored us. Yeah, it just ignored us, it's smart. Got it. Yep. That's perfect size. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no way. Oh, he came off. Oh, uh. Why have I not been doing this all day? That one's not, that's probably too big, right? What do you think? Is that too big? Um, maybe. Yeah, I would say yes. I bet I can catch a smaller one real quick. I'd say just come back. You went over. Nice, I got this one too. Nice. <laughs> I never thought that they would just eat it. Like if I just dropped it in their face. That one's probably too big too. That's the same size as the one that I just caught. Pretty. Mm -hmm. We'll get one. Oh my gosh. I w you weren't filming. <laughs> Sing for fun, you know? Yeah. That one's actually perfect size. Perfect size. Here, we'll keep on catching them. You get that? Yep. Nice. I'm just gonna throw him back. We've already got two good sizes. Okay. Right, there you go. Huge boy go. Um, we're probably gonna keep this one. We've already got two, but I think three's a good number for bait. Um, Cause we always end up losing one on like casts and stuff. So we're gonna put them in. Yeah, could I get red sauce? Just classic red sauce. Uh, just mozzarella, please. Awesome. Yeah, Trace. No, it's a fact when I see you, I'm working a square space. Yeah!
trade up but we did have fun catching some fish at the creek so but if you enjoy all right y'all the wind was so bad when me and connor went out and so i filmed this outro um you can basically hear nothing you didn't miss a whole lot though i just talked about how we did we didn't have any luck trying to trade up with that bluegill but we had some fun just a, a good day of fishing thank you all for everyone who's new to the channel um i'm sure there's a ton of you because john b shouted me out and i got like 150 to 200 subscribers out of that so thank you for coming um stay tuned for all the videos that i post because i can crank out quality videos um especially this time of the year because the fishing's good if you're wondering why i'm sitting on top of my uh my mom's jeep uh i have no idea either so thank you so much for watching this episode go do some big time fishing i'm small time fishing